I'm Razor105. I'm Bale94. Today we'll be continuing our Let's Play of uh, Pokemon Gale of Darkness. Things you can look forward to are Pokemon, more Pokemon, Gales, and Darkness. And dying bitches, crying bitches. Yes, very much so. Lots, lots of things come out of. Uh, the left one. Oh, yeah, this one. I think. I think there's a yellow machine. There's an item back there. there is. Yay! Hey, look, another item. It's probably worthless. Uh, I don't know. It's, it was kind of hidden. Surely it's not the Master Ball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like Team Aqua. Man. That'd be crazy if you found it this early. What are you ah! If you want to, if you want to pop open that chest, you gotta be me. How about I pop open your kneecap, you little douchebag? <laughs> Sneak up on me and ninja. just dig her like shotgun. <laughs> oh, I run my chop. Huh? Maybe. I wonder if any of them shadow. Cause honestly, the chop would be pretty cool. Not I like my chop. He's a beast. This guy is an optional dude. Oh, is he? So, but he's not gonna have any. Do none of the optional guys have shadows? Usually not. Because I feel like some of the best shadows should be optional. Because two of the optional guys, remember the Fujian and the Lady Bell, they were optional. Yeah, that's true. And when I say optional, I mean people that you don't run into during the main. The main quest line. The main. Quest. You figure there'd be several of those, actually. Yeah. Phoebus! Elusive little bastard! <laughs> he would be the most epic shadow Pokemon ever. I don't Just think so. kidding. <laughs> If they gave him, like, the complete makeover like they did Lugia. Why couldn't he level him up? Or not level up, but uh, evolve him. You got the trade. No, you have to Another get his beauty No, you have to get his beauty That's up. right, that's right. You can't do beauty in this, so there's no point. You do. I don't know how in the world you're supposed to do it in the other Pokemon games. Uh, a lot of, um... I wonder if they change it depending on what game it's on. It, like, in Ruby and Sapphire, you had to give him, like, a lot of... Pokeblocks or whatever the heck Yeah, use. but uh, what I'm talking about is in the next game. Oh. Since Pokeblocks don't exist. And I don't think there's a contest in a few of them. True. Hmm. Unless you can only get get them in specific contests. That's why they didn't make them very, uh... Yeah, or that's why they, he didn't return to be able to do in the wild, you know? Maybe. Yeah. Well, I'm, surely, because if you trade them over... <laughs> yeah, that's a good story. Uh, maybe you should move that. Yeah, I'm working on it, actually. That's a good question. Very good question. Good old Cerebee.net, where I get all my Pokemon. Thanks from. for asking that, fans. We, we like questions. <laughs> <laughs> Take that, Feebass. Feebass. <laughs> Feebass and Fur. <laughs> I need some Feebass. I got them better. Yeah, maybe <laughs> Feebass. The Adventures of Feebass and Goldburn. Gulpin's like, dude, I can't swim. Ah, oh, you'll be fine. <laughs> dude, I can't swim. <laughs> Just jump in. Oh, All cool. right, and then he drowns. Season over. Huh. Okay. Makuthia. <laughs> Wait, come again? So I guess we'll try... Right. You know what number he is, perhaps? Uh, no. <laughs> because I, I, I no. Definitely not. Because I've got a list here, and it'd be easier if I need a number. Google that as well, my friend. Oh, found it. He's number 349, for those of you who didn't know. Jesus. No, Feebass. Oh! Yeah. Okay, so to evolve... <clears throat> You can either level him up with maximum beauty, or you can trade with a prism scale. So yeah, you were right. Hmm. Actually, we are both right. Alternate. What game. the heck? <laughs> I figured they would do that. Actually, that's a good that idea. Was random. We're both never right. Yeah, I don't know. there's been a few arguments where it's like, <laughs> oh, you're <we're> both right. <laughs> what? <laughs> you mean hardly ever? <laughs> yeah. Reverse mode. Call. Hey, Spiel. Yeah, oh, dude, you better God. settle the fuck down. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Makuhita! 
I don't like Makuhita, but oddly enough, I like Hariyama. We always call him Harry Llama. Harry Llama. Yeah. Fuji Mama. <laughs> Harry Llama, get your... No, no. <laughs> get on the floor and shake your booty mama. You're the blast master blast in a pajama, so I'm my mama. <laughs> <laughs> That's a legit song, I swear. <laughs> By the Black Eyed Peas. By the way, I can't stand. Ah, uh, no, can I? Screw you, Black Eyed Peas. I do like how they kind of made fun of them in the uh, Vampire Stuff movie. That movie was awful! I never even watched it. I just saw the That commercial. movie sucked. The commercials were the funniest part. And they weren't even that funny. That's sad. Yeah, like, we thought, how could you take a parody movie making fun of Twilight, one of the easiest things to make fun of, how do you take that concept and make it bad? There's a lot of, like, 50, it's bad. 50 cent stand-up comedy people that, you know... Make better jokes, I suppose. Oh, yeah. I mean, I can't really say much since I haven't seen the movie, but, I mean, it's the easiest thing to make fun of ever. Actually, speaking of Twilight, did you know that Fifty Shades of Grey was originally a Twilight fanfic? It was. It is. It was originally somebody took the characters from Twilight, turned it into a fanfiction, and to sell it, they replaced all the names. Jeez. I wish I was joking. I'm not. I wish you were, too. You could actually read the entire story... As long as you can find that old fanfic. Have you read Fifty Shades of Grey? No, I haven't, but I've listened to people read it. It's hilarious. I assume I'm going to have to make a venture to read it. Maybe I we don't could... know. I mean... I wish we had a copy later. out. We could read it for the show. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much what we'd be saying a lot. Huh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Whip me again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jacob. Do it doggy style. <laughs> Not a vampire good on Probably, they probably just stick their dick normally. Yeah, they probably just stick their dick in it. Uh, technically, I am a vampire. Technically, I mean, you're I'm wrong. Of, I'm kind of pale, and I don't go out in the sunlight much. And uh, there's well, a no, there's another word for that. You know Gamer, uh, not vampire. Well, I eat them at night mostly, and uh, you know, there's a couple other things. Do you suck blood? I wear black a lot. Do you suck blood? I drink my blood when I get cut. You suck the blood of others. Yes. <laughs> I don't think we can be friends anymore. <laughs> yes, we can. Have you seen... You've look seen in, movies. Look into my eyes. <laughs> now you're a slave. Me and you get best friends. Lotad, <laughs> <laughs> what good are you for other than serving beer on? <laughs> That's a Pokemon I would have, actually, if they were legit. I'd get a Lotad, he's got a little flat head, and be like, Hey, Lotad, go give me a beer. So he'd come back with, like, a bunch of beer on his head. He could carry a bunch. <laughs> I mean, him or Machamp, because Machamp could carry four at a time. This is true. He could probably carry several. several. But Lotad could probably... He could probably carry five. Actually. Lily, uh, Lily Cove, or whatever... No, what's his name? Well, then again, a psychic Pokemon could carry as much beer as you want. Yeah. Decision, decisions. <laughs> Ludicolo, that's his name. He was Mexican, basically. Ludicrous. Oh yeah, he's the. That's a song from something that I don't remember what. That's compl that's a game song from something. I just don't remember what. I ain't got no idea. Hmm. I hate it when I remember a tune and can't remember what it's from. I do that a lot. I mean, I kind of remember things and then. Not gonna lie, I really like video game music. Like, I love remixes of it. I do too. It's just super familiar, it's awesome. Especially dubstep version, because it's just interesting to me. Kingdom Hearts is my favorite, man. Kingdom Hearts is great. Like, uh, what was the point of coming here? <laughs> to fight that guy. So you could see an Abra. If oh. you see all the Pokemon, you get something. I just haven't saw them all already. Well, actually, it's really funny, because in um, Pokemon Pearl... In order to get the next Pokedex so you can literally catch all of them, you have to see all the Pokemon in the first Pokedex. Gee. So there's one Pokemon that you can only catch on Fridays in one specific area in the evening. Or the morning. Something like that. It's Drifloon. The oh. little b weather balloon Pokemon. Uh huh. But if you don't know math, you get to see it in a gym. Because the gym is literally. Okay, this door is 73, this door is 75. What is 75 minus 2? Go through <laughs> the door that's right. So if you don't know math, 
You get to see Driftloo. <laughs> so I had to wait like a week, and then I forgot that Driftloo was showing up. So I had to wait like two weeks before I could transfer any stinking Pokemon. <laughs> you talk about mad, I was furious. That's intense. I'd be drilling my head with... Nah, I don't even know where I was going with that. I'd be drilling my head full of holes. So I was going nuts. Oh, you could be drilling it with other things, like... Happy thoughts! Happy I'm a happy little buffalo. Wow, feels <laughs> I love that episode of Digimon. There's one episode where Matt and TK are at the house, and like uh, his dad walks in and he sets down this tape, and it's got like one of them soothing like pep talk oh, things in it. About. Do you remember this episode? Yeah. And he's like, "You ought to try this, kids." And he goes, "Why?" And he's like. Well, just when you're, like, stressed out or something, just sit down, breathe, and say, I'm a happy little buffalo. And they're like, what? <laughs> Dad, you're a lunatic. <laughs> that was, like, the weirdest part ever. That's, oh, like, the funniest scene. <laughs> I forgot all about that. Yeah, that's, like, my top moment of Digimon. That's... Here, we're not even calling that. There's no point. Yeah, there is. He won't hurt himself. Yeah, but... Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Spiel can die! Liberation! <laughs> Save them all! Get ready to storm the gates! Storm the gates! <laughs> storm the gates! Actually, you still have, um... Uh, that game with Black Jack in it? <laughs> Jack Black in it? Black Jack? <laughs> uh, you mean Brutal Legend? Yeah. I believe that Crush Gaunt gave that back to me last time I was over it at his place. That'll be a little fun. So I remember I let him borrow it for a while and he never finished it. That'd be a fun little thing to do. Yeah, I want. I definitely want to play it for the show. That game's hilarious. Right. It's got a really great single player experience, but once you play through it, it's like, eh, okay. Yeah. I liked it, though. Like, I bought it almost the day it came out. I remember that. It was awesome. You're, you're it was right on my birthday, metal. actually. Yeah. <laughs> I love metal. And it's great because there's a uh, epic rock guys in it, like Ozzy's the Prince of Hell, uh -huh. like the gatekeeper or something like that, uh -huh. and then Lemmy's like, uh, he's a healer that uses bass, he's got like this car that's got all these giant bass lines, right, or maybe it's a mountain, anyways, he plays bass to heal people, it's great, and his voice is in it, and a couple other people are in it, Jack Black, obviously, Black so I mean, guy. he's hilarious. Uh, it's actually, I'm kind of wondering, you know, why haven't they made a Jackie Chan game yet? For that reason. Because <laughs> Jackie Chan. Because Jackie Chan. Remember the Jackie Chan Adventure Show? Yeah, I hate that show. Oh. The only reason I watch that show is because Yu-Gi-Oh! came on. Yu-Gi-Oh! came on later. True. And it's like, well, I got nothing to do. It's a Saturday morning and I'm about 12 years old, so what the hell am I going to do? Well, for me, it would always come on about like 8, eight o'clock, Jackie Chan would be on, and then 9 was <laughs> Pokemon? Or, Yu -Gi -Oh! or Sonic X or something. One of the two. I never really did Saturday morning. Yeah, I don't do mornings most of the time. But I mean, when I was little, I used to get up for cartoons. That was before the days of DVR, dude. I used to get up at 6 to watch Beast Wars. Huh. Beast Wars was the shit. It was like one of the first CGI shows that I can remember. And now we have Netflix. Woo. Yeah, now we have Netflix. We can watch anything. And YouTube, we can almost watch anything. Almost. And then anything that that doesn't have, you can DVR. Because yeah. we have that. Alright, we're gonna set Lady Bye out. Why don't we go to back to the Pokedex, or the PC, and grab one that's cool? Because Ladybug is like level 8. It's fine. I guess I can do it. Well, yeah, we could. We could use a healing anyway. Yeah, yeah, it could use a good healer. I'm trying to remember where the heck this place was. Dude, I'm lost. I've been lost for a while. I remember. This long. whole game's a maze. <laughs> I love this piano work in this. I know, who knows it's a genius. Yeah, it's pretty good. I oh, like shoot. it. They don't have the... Aw. Well, we can at least heal. Unless you, Unless you want to go clear back. back. Not really. I would just heal. We're not going to heal. <laughs> <laughs> we came all this way. Go uh, heal. Might as well. Don't make this a wasted trip for me. <laughs> We're going on joy We are already ride. here. We're going joy to the ride. Grand Canyon. Joy ride. In a field trip! Field trip! Go to Walmart! Go to Walmart! Go to Walmart! Wally World! Go to Wally 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 World! Wally 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 World! I love Walmart. Not really. I get off at Walmart. Oh, dude. 
I feel like I know people who have. Uh, I do know people that have, unfortunately. Like, had sex at Walmart? Yes. That, that's gotta be romantic, right? Uh, hey, hey, know. baby, meet me at Walmart. We'll do it in the clothing aisle. Well, it's... Like, you know how kids will hide in them? <laughs> yeah. Somebody goes to pick up a shirt, and there's two people screw, and it's like, uh, I don't believe I need this shirt. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you pull out a shirt, and then it breaks in half because it's the jizz on. <laughs> it's like all crusty. <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, it's like whenever you, like... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. how do you pronounce that guy's name? Is it ch is it Chimico? Chimeco. Chimeco? Yeah. Chimeco? Because instead of being an animal, he's an inanimate object. A chime. Happens. He knows Aerial Ace already? Yeah. Huh. Maybe we should have used him. Just kidding. Huh. Yeah, Roy. JK. Rolling. Rolling. <laughs> <laughs> In laughter. <laughs> 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 Every time we say something at the same time, take a shot. <laughs> <laughs> Jigglypuff is stupid. That's the worst choice for Super Smash Brothers. 150 Pokemon, and you dumb fucks pick Jigglypuff. Quite a few times, really. He's in Melee too, isn't he? Melee. He's and Brawl. And Brawl. Don't put him in the new one. Freaking Pichu. You guys are like, oh, Pichu. Mewtwo was a good idea. Why'd you take him out? Yeah, he's replaced with Lucario. I mean, Lucario was cool, granted. But! but freaking Mewtwo, Mewtwo should have. Lucario. Mewtwo's a better option than Wolf! Okay, let's have three characters who play exactly the freaking same. Yeah. And I'm what sorry, is the but... deal with taking Roy out as well? You homos. <laughs> I'm telling you what. If I get fired up. Dude, when it comes to Super Smash Brothers characters, I get aggravated. I mean, Here's what Brawl did good. Stages. Very much. It was a horrible editing system. Yeah. They could have done a okay. billion times better or just not had it. <laughs> but, not only could you play all the classic stages in HD, reskin, uh -huh. but you had new stages. Well, you can play all of them. You had to select a few. Are there like was the, still the a lot favorite. of the really good old school ones. Yeah. There was a more stage selection in that than freaking Street Fighter. <laughs> Nowadays, there's not even a stage for every character in Street Fighter, and that used to be the way you made stages. It was yeah. based off characters. <laughs> Good God. But yeah, I, the new one's supposed to be for 3DS, New Smash, I think. Yeah. More than likely, they'll release it along Wii U. Here's what I hope they do. If they, in fact, release it for both Wii U and 3DS, they must have cross-platform play, much to the in the vein of... Monster Hunter. Uh -huh. Monster Hunter, the ability to play with your buddies, one's on the TV, two or three's on the DS, all in the same room, that's amazing. The game's not even, like, super awesome, but right. that bit of that game makes it so much better and worth a play. Alright. If they do that for Smash Brothers, it'll be great, because then your buddies can bring in their 3DS, maybe you can, like, have select, like, palettes that you can make of the characters, create their colors or whatever, and then load up your custom character and fight each other like that. Everybody's got a controller, everybody's got a screen. Right. Awesome. That would be awesome. Well, Another thing that needs to be added is Gino. Gino. From Super Mario RPG. Um, He's a star trapped inside a puppet. Lin. They need Lin. Fire Emblem. Lin from Fire Emblem would be amazing. She's like, oh. She's awesome. I mean, I mean, I mean. Well, she's like, oh. well, first of all, she's good looking. Yeah. Second of all, she's got a katana. Her voice. Third of all, that's all you need. Cause she was a trophy character. And yeah, she was a trophy. And she was like, dude. And she was cool. Shadow. Uh, I. There are a couple Sonic people I would bring in. Knuckles. Knuckles. Um, you have to bring Shadow, I guess. I'm trying to think if there's any other Sega characters, the not just Sonic characters in general, but like Sega characters in general that would fit in the Super Smash Bros. universe. I really don't know anything much about. Because if they start uh, bringing Sega. in other other companies, well, that's because you know, yeah. If they start bringing in other companies, it could be interesting. Uh huh. But honestly, I feel like they shouldn't. They shouldn't do like one or two characters from other companies is a good idea. Mm-hmm. More characters from several different companies is not a good idea in my right. opinion. I feel like they should not bring back Solid Snake or, or Sonic because they're guest characters and should be specific to Brawl. Mm -hmm. Because that way we can always come back to Brawl and play as those guys. Yeah. And it, it would make... If they had all the same characters in the next one, plus more, it would make Brawl obsolete. Right. 
and it'd be like, it'd be similar to a new Madden coming out or something. Right. You would never play the other one. Why would you? So I don't think they should re-release those characters. I think a lot of the characters they have now could take a back burner. Mm -hmm. Or maybe end up as DLC if they're that freaking popular. Right. Well, and if they wouldn't make, like, like, just specifically for the Wii U, technically, I think if you just want to do it for Wii, that would be cool, too. Oh, uh, I didn't even consider Wii. Yeah, they should definitely release it for the Wii as well. I mean, Although, no, I take that back, because the Wii U is HD capable. Right. High quality, high definition. It's got a better graphics card in it than the Wii ever imagined. But I don't really want to have to go out and buy something else. Completely That's true, but... I mean, to make I, it a better game, I would prefer them release it on Wii U and 3DS. Because at the end of the day, I want a good version game version to come out. Right. I'm not really sure if I want to play it on 3DS, because it's just one of those... No. <laughs> I would. The 3DS, I kind of like. I mean, I like the 3DS. So Although, one thing that I do want to get is that Circle Pad Pro. It adds an extra thumbstick. Oh. A lot of games are utilizing that, it makes it so much better. Yeah. Because I know, I talked to uh, one of my friends, and he's playing Monster Hunter. Uh -huh. And he's like, man, you better have Circle Pad Pro. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> he's like, you cannot handle these things without Circle Pad Pro. Probably a $20 add-on or something. Yeah, oh, maybe. It's hard to tell. It's just like, it makes it bigger, and then it gives you that extra funny. So, I mean, it's like buying the XL without buying the XL. Oh, it's like if we get Truman. Yes! Huh. His little dangly ass feet! Somebody has to name Shroomish. Somebody named Shroomish. I want to keep him. Because now we have to name, keep Gulpin. Deck yeah. on it. Oh, did he? Is he purified? Uh, he's ready to be. Oh, we need to go purify him. Because we need to reveal his nickname. We can do a little special one last time. Yeah, we could. Snubble's coming down. A lot, really. He's a big baby. Granbull's cool. Snubble's a card. He's a dog in a dress. In a dress. Get him, lady bear. Don't suck. Well, it's hard. He is a ladybug, after all. I hate ladybugs. I'm not saying that lady sucks. Oh, I well. Some ladies suck, but that's okay. okay. <laughs> Some dudes suck. Mm. Huh? What are you talking about? What? Are you what? talking about blowjobs? Because that no. is not what I'm talking about. No. Not at all. That's not what I was talking about. <laughs> Stop putting words in my mouth. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Get your nuts out of my mouth. <laughs> Get them, lady mouth. Yeah! Woo! Killed something. That was pretty good. But no, back to ladybugs. I really hate ladybugs. <laughs> like, they get everywhere. You can vacuum up 10,000 a day and they still come back. Freaking stink, dude. Oh, yeah, that's the worst part. It smells horrible. Yeah, don't forget to throw a Pokeball um, at it. Yeah, I'm gonna stand and tag. So I have time to call. Yeah, that's Because I may or may not get the. Burp, burp. It's just fat to like. Yeah, it's true. I mean, it's not like I mean, if he kills Ladybug. Oh. Because if we can get him, we can make a whole big trip back and get with like, three of four of them done. That's true. We can get all of them purified. Do it at one time. Is there a place that we can uh, take already purified Pokemon to get them new nicknames? Surely. Uh, we could look it up, I guess, if we had to. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. I'm thinking. That's another thing we do. We need to do. We need to make an advertisement video for. Uh, Naming these guys. Yeah. Oh, we should do that, uh, Wings of an Angel skit. That would be hilarious. <laughs> that's what we're doing. Yeah. Oh, you son of a whore. That's, that's the first one that got out, isn't Second. it? Is it? First one in this video, uh, who did it last time? I don't know. Who did it last time? Was it Ladybug? <laughs> Might have been. Could have been. <laughs> Super Sonic! <laughs> Remember, if you die outside your game, you're gone for good. Sorry. That come from uh, Wreck-It Ralph, by the way. I know you haven't seen it, but it's awesome and you should. I was very sick to say that. Alright, cool coded. That sucks. Because it's hilarious. I saw it like three times in theaters, dude. It's so good. Whack-It Ralph? <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm gonna whack it! 
Be okay, a dude, you just need to not announce that to the world. <laughs> I mean, it's cool that you do that. A lot of people do, but it's just not something the public needs to know. That would be the sequel movie. The funniest thing, I, I, I really wanted to make a, a meme of Wreck-It Ralph and like put him up next to pictures and be like, I'm going to wreck it. <laughs> well, there's this really, I, apparently a few people have done it, where, yeah. like whenever the movie first came out. There was a picture of this chick, like from uh, Victoria's Secret or whatever, right. and it said, Who got a racket? And I'm like, ah. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody had the same idea. Somebody. Somebody. Moving the truth. Won't anybody find me? Somebody love. Those queens. In case you didn't know. I didn't. I know nothing. Communist. I ain't a communist. You didn't know that song. I knew it. I know. I, I mean, just because I don't know songs doesn't mean I don't hear them. Did you maybe come to rescue Quain? Yes. Yeah, more than likely. I mean, he is the professor and we are the protagonist, and you did, in fact, kidnap him. Alright, run away, little sissy. No, oh, look, he left an item like all the dumb folks ever do. Bet you it's a key card. What's up? He's just like, oh, you want that card? That's cool, dude. <laughs> just take it. I'm just gonna. Mm. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, he's Mexican. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, he's Alpha 5. Love Power Rangers. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm Razor105. Bale94. We'll catch you next time on Forever Classic. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Name a Pokemon. Name a Pokemon. We're definitely releasing an advertisement video for that.